Yeah, and then I'm just saying, like, how how is going to that that um that that um virtual reality uh, the latest virtual reality glasses or virtually virtual reality headset that they want to put on their head? You know, it kind of remind me of the Professor X when he's you know when Professor X is in that that danger room or that professor x room the x-men and you put the cerebro on the head and you can see all different types of stuff you know and you got control they said like you can use your eyeballs just move your eyeballs around and it controls the machine or how you move your fingers and your hands if you move your hands or your fingers in a certain way it can control that machine you know People they have the people already got that technology. So like some people are talking about that uh, they don't want no chip uh, embedded in their forehead, or they don't want no chip in the in the uh, in the hand or in the back of their hand. This uh, this machine or this program may have that chip that the people are trying to avoid, but is is in a way that we wouldn't think that it can be the chip, you know? Like, they can make, uh, some people make a, 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 a candy taste as good, right? Yeah, if, if you eat too much candy, it's not good for your teeth. But this stuff, you know, I don't know. Like, if you use this, if you use this type of technology in the wrong way, I believe it's gonna do harm. But also, it's like a double-edged sword. But if a person uses it in the right way, it will benefit. Uh, I believe it will benefit the humanity, this uh, new uh, form of technology. It's a tool. See, some people might use a tool in the right way or they might use it in the wrong way, just like Fire, fire can be bad. Fire can burn down houses. Fire can kill people. Fire can, you know, cause problems. But you can use uh, the fire to warm up uh, your your uh, a cabin. You know, uh, if to to warm and be warm enough to warm a baby, the baby feel comfortable on a cold, freezing winter's night when you're in your cabin or when you're in your house. You know. And near the chimney, it got a nice little warm, little cozy place. You know, the little little baby is comfortable. You know, you know even water. You know, if you drink a, you drink some good water. You know, drink some alkaline or drink some spring water. It's good for you. It's healthy. But too much water, a person could get drowned. So, I think they. I think I think it. I think it's like this. Same thing as the tablet. You're not supposed to have a tablet on your lap. You're not. You're supposed to have the tablet on the table. You're not supposed to have your laptop on your lap. You're supposed to have your 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 laptop on the table, and your phone or your well your smartphone. You're not supposed to constantly have it near your head. It can uh, cause damage to the body. So I believe. I believe that this is a benefit, this new technology, but I believe we should um, have days to stay away from this type of technology. You know, stay away for it for like three days, you know, stay away from that type of technology and interact with real life. You know, just like I said, stay away from the laptop or stay away from your smartphone, stay away from your flat TV, stay away from your 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 smartphone for a while for like two or three days because if you only know the technology and and you only and you're not talking to human beings then that's not that healthy you got to go out and talk to human beings sometimes you know but i i looked at it it's a it's it's a nice uh it's a nice um technology you know, that new Apple virtual reality uh, headset. It, it, it looks like it looks thorough, but 
I think people shouldn't stay on it too long. I don't think you should stay on it for for days and months and years. I think that you should just like look at it for like three days and then stay off of it for like three days or be on it one day and stay off it for three days or be on it two days and then stay off it for three days. Thank you for listening. Peace.